it, it's time to step it up with your American Bulldog or your Pitbull or your Cane Corso or your Bull, uh, uh, um, Bull Terrier or your Akita or your Borbul. It's, it's time to be a guy who does what he says or a girl and says what she means and follows up and walks where she wants to walk and does what she wants to do. Jax, the American Bulldog, is gonna meet Prince. You guys, I posted a video a few days ago of his sister, Gemma and Jax, and me walking them, and them seeing a dog, and they have leash reactivity. We put her away because he's worse with meeting dogs when she's around. So, he hasn't met Prince yet. They've been here two days, him and his sister. We're gonna be careful with this. Look how big and strong this dog is. You think Prince is gonna be all happy with this guy going at him? Absolutely not. We are gonna walk them together. I don't wanna go up on a big walk in the street, so we're gonna use the facility. You're gonna get a little tour of the facility as well. So we're gonna walk around here. We're gonna walk kinda of near my office. We're gonna walk around. Carly's gonna work Prince, and we're gonna walk around this place, okay? And that's what we're gonna do. Then hopefully they're gonna meet. Maybe, like we're gonna to walk together. Smell, how I always recommend is one dog walks in front, they walk on the side, then one's in front, then the other's in front, and maybe there's a meeting, maybe there's not a meeting. We'll see how it goes. And then, we're gonna go, hopefully, hopefully no muzzle, but maybe we'll use a muzzle, have a meet. We wanna get these guys together, okay? So, that's the process. He has problems with dogs. That's why he's here. Go ahead and grab Prince. Yeah, she's gonna go get your buddy. I have a gentle leader on him for control. He's too big and too strong. I have a double ply, six foot leash. I'm a big fan of double ply leashes for big dogs. You guys often ask what kind of leash I use. It's just a nylon leaf, leash but double ply, so it's thicker. So this is just desensitization, right? Getting them together without having them together. People often get a rescue dog. I'm ready. Uh, they get, they want their friend's dog to come over. The best thing is just desensitization. The dog's just being with each other without being with each other, if that makes sense. Fences, leashes, desensitizing, but not being together, okay. There's Princey. Yeah, is that your buddy? You wanna go see your buddy? Okay, so let's walk. Hey, it looks good. We're not ready to let this meeting happen, but he looks good. Come on. You walk with me, Carly, we're just gonna cruise. Traveling together as a pack is a really wonderful thing. I'm not, you wanna walk on the right? I don't really care. Okay, we're gonna go through here. Here's your tour. Your tour begins. I often post videos here, you've seen that. This guy pulls, he walks in front of me, he leaves. He hits his big old cinder block head on my leg because he wants to, he wants to get his gentle leader off. None of it matters to me. I don't really care that this guy wants to go see Prince. I don't really care that this guy, that's not my attitude for all dogs, that's my attitude for this dog and this breed. My five-year-old wants to eat candy, stay up late, and watch YouTube videos of Beck Bro Jack. It's not the best thing for him. This dog wants to get the gentle leader off, go rush up to that dog, and maybe tell that dog what's up. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what he wants to do. Come on. And that's the, look at him with his big head. He uses his big, giant cinder block head as not a weapon, but nothing hurts it. Hence, why not slam it into this guy's leg? I do a lot of videos on like the attitude to have with your dog. This video is that, is that exact type of video. This isn't even a getting him used to him video. Partly is, and it's partly, it's enough of, dog people and people in general and people listening to society and it's time to step it up with your American Bulldog or your Pitbull or your Cane Corso or your 
bull, uh, uh, um, bull terrier or your Akita or your boar bull. It's, it's time to be a guy who does what he says or a girl and says what she means and follows up and walks where she wants to walk and does what she wants to do. That's, be that type of person with 100 pound American Bulldogs. Sit. I'm not asking, I'm not begging, I'm not gonna lure you with a treat so you do it. He knows it, so he's gonna do it. Now, I know I'm gonna, I, I, I have this attitude for these videos because many of you need the attitude, right? You guys need to kind of be told, it's like a personal trainer, like, come on, you gotta do your push-ups every day, it's not messing around. That's why I have this attitude for these videos. Okay, let's go. Hi, buddy. I'm walking. Okay, Carla, you open that gate. This isn't about basic obedience. You want, you want a dog like this, American Bulldog, to listen to you? It's not about sits and downs. It's about like just being the type of person, being a certain type of person. Where is he going? I don't know where he's going. He's on leash though. There are rules. Don't hit the end of the leash. So these guys are just getting to know each other. We probably won't use a muzzle, I'm guessing. He looks good. Let's go up here and do this. We'll go up here. Oh, here, let him, let him smell. Here, smell your buddy. Just keep him right there. Yeah, you wanna see? This is why walking with a dog is so good. That's why walking dogs together are so good. I don't do that here. I have a process that I do, but, oh yeah, go ahead and flip Prince around. Let someone say hi. Yeah. Oh, Jax looks so good. Jax, you like him. I'm not saying he wouldn't have liked him up there, but my little spiel to you down there and my walking into him and my him hitting the end of the leash right there, that makes me the one in charge of this meeting. You want the aggressive dog, which he is not, but you want the dog you're not sure of to go, here, yeah, there's that dog, I don't love that dog, but like, this guy's serious. That's what you want in life with your big, strong dog, with your dominant dog, with your aggressive dog, with your reactive dog, with your, yeah, mainly those things. You go say hi to your friend. Now you can soften it up. He's proven We've got our point across, now we can soften it up. This dog came, came to us for dog issues. That's why he's here. This is not a perfect dog, okay? And he says, I wanna wipe this off on you. No, you're not. I'm not, you guys, if you have a King Charles Spaniel that's 10 weeks old, this video doesn't apply to you, right? Those are the softest dogs in the world. This is for the big, the strong dogs. The dogs you're not sure of. I know, buddy. You gonna say hi to Princey? You gonna say hi to Princey? Here, bring Prince over here. Yeah. Yeah, there's your buddy. Prince doesn't care. Prince, Prince, do you care about this guy at all? He usually wants to meet the dogs. You don't care. Okay. So, why, why does Prince listen to me? It's because of a presence that I have around Prince. Why do all the dogs listen to me? It's that way. And that's what I'm trying to impart to you guys. I'm not saying there's not other channels like this out there, but I don't think there's a lot of channels like this out there. So you have a certain breed, you have certain problems, start here, okay? That's why I say like, get them out of your bed. When they don't come to you, you go get them. Don't let them jump on you and don't let them pull you down the street. My four keys to aggression that needs to be done before the aggression in life are those four things. Those four things are just this. I'm coming to get you when you don't come to me. I'm not letting you jump on me. That's just this attitude that I'm imparting to you today, okay? And when a dog does certain things, tries to get the gentle leader off, says I'm pulling, says I'm lunging, we're not messing around, okay? You're not messing around. Hopefully that makes sense. That was Jack's meeting sort of prints, they're good together. They're good now, I love it. That's the video. Please, if you like the video, 
like the video. That's it.